Whew, okay. What up? This is Devontae from Devontae's Paradise. I finally got used to the recording and all that shit. So, um, uh, you know, a lot of people are going to question question me on this one. Uh, this is a legendary, this is a classic video. Um, I want to give my two takes, my two take on this. Because this is one of those legendary, you know, how every YouTuber has that one video that just, hmm, you know, something, there's something about this video. Uh, this guy, for this guy, it's this video. Now, let me give you a disclaimer, right? Um, what he says, well, I always try to like, I always like to explain the videos. Let me not explain the video. Let me hear it. You know what? Y'all can hear this shit. Bear with me. We in for a ride, yo. Hello, and welcome to the realest. I said the realest. Nigga. Alive. You know, ever since I came out of the hospital, I've been putting on some pounds because I did lose a lot of weight in the hospital, so I had to eat healthy, but I had to eat a lot. I've been getting my body in shape. I'm looking much better. Um, I woke up in the mirror this morning. I'm like, you know, I'm looking a little bit sexy, you know what I'm saying? So I start teasing myself a little bit. I start putting down my box a little bit, and I'm looking. I'm like, oh, my shit looking dumb fat. Like, to be honest, if I was if I was a girl, I would, I would suck my shit. I really would. <laughs> Bear with me, y'all, you know. Let's keep going. Uh, and then I thought to myself, I said, hmm, if I was a nigga, I think I would still suck my shit. And then I thought to myself, matter of fact, I'm about to suck my shit right fucking now. And I started thinking, wait a minute, I don't even know how to suck dick. Like, how can I consider myself a real man? Because at the end of the day, when you were alpha male, you know how to do everything. You know what I'm saying? When you were alpha male, you have to know if a nigga's cute. If you're walking down the street with your girl and a nigga's cute and he says hi to your shorty and you're like, oh, that nigga ugly. And every man is ugly to you because you're so straight. How are you going to know who's a threat? How are you going to know what's competition in your real niggerness? You feel me? <laughs> so you got to give credit where it's due. You got to know if a nigga's cuter than you. You feel me? You got to know if a nigga's attractive. That's what an alpha male's being about. It ain't gay. It's just knowing your competition. And to keep it a buck, you got to know how to suck dick if you want to be a real man. You feel me? Okay, so with the first part, I agree with him on that. The second part, I don't know exactly what he means. Um, damn, I lost my train of thought. I, I just, I, I, I it's kind of hard to explain this. It's kind of hard to explain this. It's like, I'm hoping he's talking in metaphors. I hope he's not serious. I, you know, um, shout out to the LGBTQ. I don't have anything against y'all. Don't use this against me, but uh, I'm hoping he's talking in metaphors. He's talking in metaphors. Let's let's keep going. He's talking in metaphors. Is that the ice cream? Ah, oh, man, I wanted some ice cream too, yo. That shit went fast. As hell. Before y'all start going ape shit, let me explain myself. You feel me? Because at the end of the day, y'all know that oh, he I turned take it around. shit. That y'all niggas think is wrong, and I make that shit right. Because at the end of the day, I'm the realest nigga alive and I overexpose shit that y'all niggas never saw before. Now, if you walking down the street and you in the struggle, OD like you broke, niggas is about to evict you next month type shit. And a rich white nigga walks up to you and he says, I give you a billion dollars if you suck my dick right now. First of all, that nigga ain't even asking you for how long you should suck that shit. Hypothetically speaking, that nigga tells you five minutes. Would you rather be gay for five minutes or stupid for life? Because if Stupid for life? Stupid for life, baby. Stupid for life. What the fuck? <laughs> oh no, run that back. Run that back. He said gay for five minutes. No, you're you gotta live that shit for the rest of your life. You gotta live, you gotta walk around. You gotta walk around as a guy and said, I just sucked a dick for five minutes for a billion dollars. That shit doesn't go away. That shit doesn't go away. 
or see five minutes. Would you rather be gay for five minutes or stupid for life? Stupid for life. Because if you don't suck that dick and you giving up a billion dollars, you're a fucking idiot. With a billion dollars, I could buy me a whole new fucking mouth. I'll take the five minutes of faggotry. Thank you very much. No. I'm just sucking that dick. No. I promise you. If you a real nigga and you stay talking about that you getting this paper, you're going to do whatever it takes, you feel me? Because money's the motive, you feel me? Talking all this shit about you getting paper, and at the moment that there's opportunity to get paper, you ain't going to do that shit. At Yo, the end of the day, up. it's a gay action. To get this what you do doesn't make you gay. It's the intentions behind it. It's whether you like it or not, you feel me? I could kiss a nigga. That don't make me gay. I could fuck a nigga in his ass if I wanted to. See, this is the... This is... Whoo, shit. This, we gonna call this the Daylight Theory, right? Um, Daylight got on, on DJ Vlad. He was trolling. But there is people that are actually gonna go by the rule of thumb that, hey, Daylight said, I might suck a dick or two, but that don't make me gay. You still gotta live with that. See, I don't, I gotta keep this video going. That don't mean I'm gay. I could just do it just to do it. And I'll still be straighter than a fucking pencil. If you're giving me money, why not? I get this money. I'm about this money life. You feel me? Y'all niggas stay talking about y'all about this money life, but y'all powered by bitches. Y'all bitch made ass niggas. Do anything for pussy. You feel me? Do anything me. to look good for pussy. Not talking me. about, nah, I'm straight, my nigga. What I mean like one of my girl talking about that I just sucked dick for this billion dollars. Nigga, fuck that bitch. You got a billion dollars, you could buy yourself a billion bitches with that. But I wouldn't buy a billion bitches, you feel me? I'm not a bitch made nigga. I'm not out here trying to impress women. I'm not trying to get women. I'm about this paper, you feel me? When you get paper, when you chase the money, women follow. When you chase women, you losing money, you feel me? I forgot who said that. I think it was like Kane. When you chase women, you losing money, you feel me? I forgot who said that. I'm about this paper, you feel me? When you get paper, when you chase the money, women follow. When you chase women, you losing money, you feel me? I forgot who said that shit. I think it was like Kane Carter or some shit. Or Spoken Reasons. It was one of them black niggas. But there's some real ass niggas, you feel me? Gotta give credit where it's due, you feel me? Niggas can't chop me with that fucking copyright bullshit. Scenario number two. You walking down the street, it's two o'clock at night, and five niggas come up to you, and they say, give it up. You take out your wallet, they say, I'm not talking about that. Them <laughs> niggas wanna fuck you. You gotta hit them niggas with the alternative, like, yo... I can't at least suck y'all niggas' dicks or some shit because I'm dead not trying to get fucked right now. First of all, I got a phobia of blood. Creep! Second of all, if you getting fucked in your ass, that's enough time for you to start liking that shit because there's a prostate gland right there. That's the male G-spot, you feel me? You're going to start liking that shit and then you're just going to start getting fucked by niggas on the regular. In any situation, not for money, not for nothing. You're just going to start wanting to get fucked. And I don't want to get fucked, you feel me? That's just not because it's gay because at the end of the day, it's not the action that makes you gay. It's the intentions. But only because I don't want to waste my time. That time that I'm wasting wanting to get fucked by niggas, I could just be getting more paper, you feel me? And I'm not a prostitute. I'm not going to charge niggas to fuck me in my ass, you feel me? But if you just sucking dick for money, that's just being like a food tester, you feel me? You doing the ice cream flavor test. You just sucking the cone for a little bit for, for some money, you feel me? You giving them feedback on how they taste. If you getting fucked, that's just straight up prostitution. So yeah, at the end of the day, you gotta know how to suck dick. I don't understand, like, if it's a life or death situation, like, why would you not rather suck the dick? You suck five dicks for a little bit, for like five minutes, rather than getting fucking plowed by like five niggas. I'd rather suck the dick, you feel me? I'm not getting it in my ass, you feel me? Because if you sucking dick, you sucking dick, that shit don't hurt. Sucking dick don't hurt. Getting fucked in your ass is definitely gonna fucking hurt you for like, Yo, this I this this nigga might be coming out because to just do this out the blue, it's 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 kind of funny. It's kind of funny. He but he's he's saying he's, it's like he's saying it in a way where it's like, oh no, I'm just doing it for it's like all my niggas know. Everybody that's seen his video is gonna know. Like yeah. yeah. This guy right the here. first 30 seconds, you feel me? I don't know about the rest of the time because I never got fucked in my ass. I suck dick, so I never had to deal with that shit. The smart bitches are the ones that suck dick because they don't got to get fucked. They don't got to waste energy, you feel me? They just suck the dick and make that nigga nut right away, you feel me? The better you are sucking dick, the faster them niggas nut, you feel me? And then the job is done, you feel me? 
If a nigga offered you a billion dollars, would you not suck that nigga dick no. if he said, I'll give you a billion dollars no. to suck my dick? No. It's a billion fucking dollars, no. nigga. I could buy you an esophagus with no, half of nigga. that money. You really get me tight, yo. Anyway, it's been real, everybody. It was the realest. The realest. Nigga. Alive. Listen, man, at the end of the day, it's not like sucking dick is my profession. You feel me? All I'm saying is that if this video shit don't work out, you got to respect the hustle. You feel me? If you got to suck dick for money, you got to suck dick for money. It's not gay as long as you're going home to a woman with that money. As so long no, as you... no, 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 no. You, you, you cannot change the rules. You can't change the... Stop trying to change the fucking rules. Stop trying to change the fucking rules. Y'all niggas is crazy, yo. Calling a woman with that money, you feel me? At the end of the day, we will all be the realest nigga alive as long as you listen to the realest nigga alive. First name, realest. Middle name, nigga. Last name. Love! How'd you take that? Just wiggity, it, wiggity, it, wiggity, it, wiggity, that. They say facts that ever since little bit to the way niggas that say strap. Like, so what? Brother can't get older, make better. Now you look at this picture. You 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 look at this whole rant and you look at this picture. And you're gonna be like, man. No disrespect to the LGBTQ. But this nigga is thinking about sucking dick. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Like, comment, subscribe. And again, I'm not dissing them. You know what I mean? Because if you do it, you do it. You can be straight up with it. But it's kind of like with this video, it's like he's saying that he's not just going to do it. First, first, this is how it goes. First is like, I don't like that. Then it's like, man, you know, if I'm in a situation, you're creating these scenarios where you you're creating these scenarios in your head where you can make an excuse to yourself so you can suck dick. Then you'd be like, oh, I'm gay. <laughs> Shit crazy, man. <laughs> Peace.